Hey YouTube, welcome to a new video. I am Philip Jacob and you are watching Metal Beats. On today's video, we are going to be seeing the review on the all new Polero Neo. So this is the all new Bolero Neo, the addition to the Bolero family and as you can notice it has grown in its design and looks also. So this car actually shares the same chassis as the third generation Scorpio. So let's go in detail about this car and see its review. So while checking the front portion of the car, the first thing we notice is these headlamps. They are beautifully designed, they have a wrapped around design with the daytime running lamps on them. And while checking the grills, you get the Mahindra grill which gives that signature look. You also get the slats which are in chrome finishing. And while checking out the bumpers, you get the dual tone colors on them. Looking from far away, it does give a good look for the car. You also get the fog lamps and a honeycomb design structure over here. And while checking out the hood, you get the flat hood with a small groove in both the sides wherein while driving you will be able to see the hood and also gives you the king's driving position. And while checking the side profile of the car, the first thing we notice are the wheels. You get 15 inch alloy wheels on this top end variant. It differs between the other variants. But the top end, you get the 15 inch alloy wheels. And just like the Bolero, you get the cladding on them. You also get the V arch cladding too. You get a huge mirror which has an electronically adjustable mirror inside. And you also get a footboard for easy entry and exit. And if you focus a little bit more near the window line, you'll be able to notice a small stickering over there which actually makes it blend into the paintwork which actually gives a very good look when you see from far away. So while checking the rear portion of the car, as you can notice you get the Bolero branding with the new logo also. You get the handle to open and close the doors. You get the spoiler, gives a very good sporty effect. You get the tail lamp with the halogen bulbs in them, gives a very good look. It has that transparency kind of a finish to it. You also get the rear sensors so that now reversing is not an issue. You get a step for easy entry and exit. And while checking out the rear wheel, you get this X shape with Bolero branding and Mahindra logo inside. It gives a very good look when you stand far away and see the car's rear. And while checking out the rear door, it has a wide opening. You have a handle out here and also to open up from inside. So let's see how it is for a grown-up to sit at the back. I can use this handle out over here. It's pretty comfortable, but for a grown-up, a temporary short travel would be comfortable, but for a long drive, I would suggest only kids in this seat. And while checking the heart of the Bolero Neo, you get a M Hawk 100 engine, which is BS6. It's a diesel powered engine. It has 1493 cc. It produces 100 bhp and 260 newton meters of torque. So right now we are seated inside the all new Bolero Neo and as you can notice I have a beautiful steering wheel with multifunctions on them. Left hand side I have the controls for the telephone and the media too. Whereas on the right hand side I have the controls for the cruise control. I have the beautiful Mahindra logo in the middle. It's a four spoke design. And while checking out the instrument cluster I have the tachometer to my left and the speedometer to my right and also a small digital instrument cluster through which you get various other information. And just beside the steering wheel you have a button called ESS which means that it is a micro hybrid and you also have a eco mode through which you can increase your driving efficiency. You have the headlight adjustments, the defogger and also the outer rear view mirror controls over here. And while checking out the doors, you get a grab handle, which is in silver color. You have the lock and a bottle holder and a small space also over here. Pretty good finish on the doors. 
And while checking the dashboard, you get a Italian design for this car's interior. You get a small space wherein I can keep my mobile phone. I have silver accents around all over here. I have the AC vents also over there. There's a dual tone color combinations running out over here. I have a 17.8 centimeter touchscreen system, which has various functionalities on them. You have a lot of time to fidget around. Going further down, I have the controls for the air conditioning, which is completely manual, but you also get a AC eco mode too, so that you are being economic. I have a 12 volt charging point, a USB port and an aux port too, a small space out here, a manual five speed gearbox. Further down, I have controls for all the mirrors and also the locks for the windows, a proper manual handbrake, few spaces out here to keep your bottles and also maybe mobile phones or your wallet the front two seats have the hand wrist, so it is pretty comfortable for the driver and also for the passenger when he has this beside him a pretty good design and the seats are fabric you have a very good support in the seats also the driver seat also gives me a lot of support as for safety system, I have two airbags, one for the driver and one for the passenger. Apart from that, the car also gets anti-lock braking system with electronic brake distribution. For the rear seats, especially for childs, you have the Isofix seats. You have the reminder for your seat belt, automatic door locks and things like that. It's a pretty safe space to be driven in. So right now I'm seated at the rear and I have a decent amount of space at the back. I can stretch my legs all the way to the front because I have a deep footwell out there. And while checking out the headroom, I have loads of headroom out here. And also the headrest gives a great support. I also have the handrest. It is covered. I'm not able to open it right now. But all in all, a great space to be seated at the rear. So that's it from me guys on the all new Bolero Neo. If you have any inquiry towards the car, especially the people in Bangalore, Please do step by Sirish Auto. They have the vehicle in stock and they also have the test drive car. Please do get in touch with them for any inquiries. I hope you like this video. Please do like, share and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys later in another video with another car. Until then, goodbye.